What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video today here on Codename Pizza and welcome back to a brand new top 5 here on the channel as well where we're going to be counting down the top 5 rarest drops inside of zombies. Now I know what you're thinking, there's not that many drops inside of zombies. Well you are wrong. Zombies is not just max, ammos, double points, insta kills. There's so many other drops inside of zombies that we may have only seen once or twice or it's been really really rare to actually get that drop and that's what we're going to be looking at today. Now before we jump into this top 5, let me just say that you guys have absolutely killed it this week on the other videos and the other live streams so thank you so much and if you haven't done already make sure you absolutely smash that like button right now where we're gonna aim for let's say 2,115 likes you guys can definitely do that and if you are brand new to the channel click that subscribe button and let me know inside the comment section every single one of these that you guys have had so just like me right here if you have got number five put five yes if you've got number four put four yes if you've got number two but you've never had number one put two yes one no you'll know what i mean when we get over to it but let's start the countdown of the top five rarest drops inside of zombies number five so coming in at number five is probably one of my favorite drops that we've only ever seen once inside of zombies on one map and one round only. And you guys know exactly what I'm saying right here. This is going to be the bonfire sale on the map. Five. Now, considering 5 got released in 2010, I cannot believe that we have never seen this drop return into Zombies in a whole 7 years. This is unbelievable how this is only on one map. But, let me tell you what Bonfire Sale is right now. It's really cool. You go on the map 5, you wait for the special round to begin. When the Pentagon Thief comes out of his little teleporter, he will try and steal your weapons. And you have to kill him before he has the chance to come over and take that weapon off you. And if you do do that, and if you manage to kill the Pentagon Thief before he gets to you then he will drop the bonfire sale now this drop looks exactly like the packer punch machine and that is exactly what this does as soon as you pick this up make your way over to the packer punch machine and that allows every single gun that you have in your inventory to be upgraded for 1000 points that's right so right now i have the ray gun and i also have the rpk now i actually get to upgrade both of these for just 2000 points that's right so going from a couple of good weapons to going to insane weapons super early rounds for this one thousand point trick is really really helpful and we've probably not seen it in zombies in the future because it's really overpowered super super op but that is why bonfire sale is at number five so if you guys ever had the bonfire sale put a five inside the comment section and a yes right now if you have and let's go and see what is that number four number four so coming in at number four, we have got another very, very rare drop. Now the thing with this drop is it actually goes towards upgrading a certain item inside of zombies. And we only ever get to see it once in one game and in one map. So only one map has this. You can only do it once per game and it's really, really rare. And we are of course talking about the blue flask on Gorad Krovi. Now to get this thing to drop, you have to get monkey bombs out of the mystery box. And as soon as you have those, you need to start trying to get kills. The earlier rounds, the better unless you're taking an insta-kill drop with you. Now, what you need to do is get 50 zombie kills with the monkey bombs, and as soon as you kill that 50th zombie, it will then drop the blue flask. Now, this blue flask is part of a bigger easter egg where you've got to go and collect the flowers, the candle, and also this blue flask. Make your way back over to the spawn area, and then throw a monkey bomb down at this gravestone, and it will unlock the upgraded monkey bombs. But this drop right here is only available on Gorad Krovi, and only if you get 50 kills with the monkey bombs, and that's why I thought it could easily take the fourth place spot on this list. So if you guys ever had the blue flask, if you have, make sure you put number four inside of the comment section right now and the number yes. If not, put four and no. That was pretty rare, but from now on on the list, we are getting insanely rare. We are getting to the point where some of these I have never had in my entire life. Now, let's jump on to number three. Number three. So coming in at number three, this was very, very difficult. These top three places are so close to each other, I didn't know what to put as number three. But we are jumping in with number three as the weapons drop on IW. Now, I reckon in my entirety history of IW, I would say I probably played around a thousand games. I probably had this around 10 times maximum. So I'm going to do that as maybe a one in 100 games. You will get this upgrade. And I actually got it in one of the best case scenarios that I have ever had it before. And that was in the 
starting room. I was doing a starting room challenge on Zombies in Spaceland, and I was lucky enough to actually unlock the upgraded weapon drop. Now, this drop is completely random, and you have no idea when you are going to get it. Like I said, probably a 1 in 100 games chance of getting this, and this will upgrade both the weapons in your inventory to be pack-a-punched weapons. It's a very, very valuable drop if you do get it early on on games, or if you are just struggling in ammo in general, and it definitely helps you out because you are saving 10,000 points just by picking up this drop, or if you've already got pack a bunch weapons, you can pick this up and save yourself 20,000 points because it'll upgrade it to double upgraded weapons as well. This drop is so incredibly rare, but it's difficult to believe that this is only number three on our list right now. There are two drops rarer than this inside of zombies that we are going to be getting on to right now. But let me see the number three inside the comment section right now with either a yes or a no if you have ever had this or not had this drop inside of zombies. But boys, let's move on to something even rarer than this. Let's jump on to number two. Number two. So coming in at number two, this was difficult. I didn't know whether to do this one or the next one as number two or number one. But we are going to be jumping into this number two slot. It takes place on Der Eisendrag. I have only ever had this once. And I reckon I have probably played Der Eisendrag around 2,000 times. And this is the Ray Gun drop. That's right, boys. There is a drop that gives you a ray gun on the eyes and track, and this comes from the gondola. Now, all you've got to do is make sure you have a tram fuse. Go and place it into the tram fuse station, and the tram will come up to the station, and if you are lucky enough, you will unlock the ray gun from this drop. Now, like I said, I've probably played the eyes and track 2,000 times, probably even more if I'm being honest, and I have only ever had this once. On the first week of the eyes and track being released, I managed to get this drop. It's incredible incredibly incredibly rare and you know what considering it's so rare you would think that they would give you an upgraded ray gun right they would be a little bit kinder but no it's just the original ray gun that they actually give you and i don't think that's good enough for how rare this actually is because this is insanely rare like one time out of 2000 is ridiculous but the ray gun drop on the eyes and drag is at number two and make sure you guys tell me in the comment section right now as well if you have ever had the ray gun drop on the eyes and drag by putting number two and then either a yes or a no but boys it is now time for the rarest drop in the entirety of zombies ever on any game ever that had zombies on all of the call of duty zombie games let's do this here we go number one so coming in at number one, some of you guys may already know this, but this is the rarest drop inside of zombies. Now this is so rare that I have never ever had this. So I would put in the comment section number one, no. And this is the blue max ammo. That's right. Normal max ammo is a green, but there's actually a blue max ammo inside of Black Ops 3 Zombies, which gives you either a Shiva, it will give you an XM53, or it will give you a ray gun. That's right. It randomly gives you one of three weapons just randomly, and no one knows why. This thing isn't available for killing zombies. It's not available for doing an Easter egg. It's nothing like that. All you've got to do is pop the I'm feeling lucky gobblegum and be the most luckiest person on the entire planet to get this drop. This drop rate is probably 1 in 100,000. I know someone that got this, and it took them three days of non-stop games and using I'm Feeling Lucky Gobblegum. There's no other way to get it except from using that Gobblegum, and you have to be extremely, extremely lucky. So all of this came around on the release of Revelations. One guy got the I'm Feeling Lucky Gobblegum, he popped it, and he got a blue max ammo. Now, at the time, we didn't realize it was just going to be a blue max ammo for I'm Feeling Lucky. We thought there was so much more behind this, and the thing that we thought it was going to be was a side easter egg giving us a different announcer for the map so we have the shadow man announcing some of the quotes and we would also have dr monty announcing some of the quotes as well giving us blue drops instead of the original green drops inside of the game now this would have been insane to see what the rest of these drops would have done let's say if we got a blue insta kill what would have that done or a blue fire sale maybe that could have brought bonfire sale back i don't know that is how all of this is connected it's absolutely insane and that is why it's on our list at number one but let me see it inside the comment section right now let me see if any of you guys have been lucky enough to unlock the blue max 
ammo. Put number one and either yes or no inside the comment section right now. And boys, that has been the top five countdown of the rarest drops inside of zombies. If you guys enjoyed this video at all, make sure you absolutely smash that like button right now. We will aim for 2,115 likes on this video. And also make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you are brand new to become the latest member of the pizza club. Feel free to leave inside the comment section other top fives that you want me to do on the channel and I will feature your comment in the next top five. But guys, thank you so much for watching and I will of course see you in the next video or the next live stream. Thanks for watching guys and peace out.